Material science is the study of everything around us. And we want to understand what is its structure, how is it put together, how are the atoms inside it arranged. If you think about the history of civilization, it is really the history of material science, right? We even name it after materials, the Golden Age, the Bronze Age, the Iron Age, then the Silicon Age as computing came into its own. And so we see that the history of humans is driven by the history of material science. We study so many different topics within the course. So I do biology, chemistry, computing, coding, physics. It's, it's what appealed to me most, I think, the variety. When I applied, I came for an interview. It was more of a chat. Uh, to be honest, so why I wanted to come to Imperial, what appealed. They also asked a few physics questions, a few maths questions, just to see how we thought. The materials course at Imperial is delivered by 35 or so academics, as well as uh, a whole range of talented teaching staff, and we encompass the whole ensemble of materials. We draw them together in the first two years where we get this fundamental understanding that's across the whole of our discipline. And then in the last two years of the undergraduate course, we then specialise in specific core courses that you would elect to choose and using those to highlight and develop ideas and theories that will help you use these skills in the workplace. The facilities in the Department of Materials are cutting edge. We have a dedicated lab specifically for our fourth year research students that has x-ray instruments, it has electron microscopes, it has atomic force microscopy. Then we have cutting edge approaches to interpret that data. And so combining those all together enables us to have that next generation understanding that you as a student can be driving in your research project. My main focus of my research is titanium in jet engines, uh, so I'm really aerospace focused. So for example, we had something called the blue spot problem. Industry came to us with that problem and asked us if we could help solve it, and we did. And because of that, now, engines are flying safer, which is not just cool, but really inspirational to know that you're making a difference. I really enjoy the course. I love how interactive it is. We have labs every week. It also gets you used to equipment that you could be using for your like third and fourth year projects. It's also really nice because everyone's really friendly. You know a lot of people. I have got friends in second and third year. If I need any help with work or anything, I can always go to them. It was a great background for very many different kinds of career. Of course, many of our graduates love material science so much they want to carry on, they want to do research, they want to take their material science knowledge forward. Other students, of course, take the knowledge they've gained into other fields. Many people go and work in the city, or they work in design, or in different engineering kinds of applications. With my materials degree, I have plans to become an entrepreneur. I would like to produce new materials and uh, further our understanding of science and nature as a whole. Whatever I do or whatever that's being done at Imperial is based on the foundation of curiosity and the desire to learn something new. And that's actually what keeps me excited about learning such a fundamental subject.